During his second day of testimony, meanwhile, George Wagner IV was cross-examined by prosecutors. He is on trial for murder in the Pike County massacre that happened in 2016. NBC4's Jonathan Jackson joins us now to tell us the state pointed out several inconsistencies, Jonathan, in his statements. Yeah, they did, Jennifer, especially when he was questioned by BCI agents a little over a year after the Roden family murders. Did you know your family was going to kill these people? No. For the second day in a row, George Wagner IV denied having any involvement in the killings of the Roden family in 2016. Wagner, along with his mother, father, and brother, are all accused of planning and carrying out the murders. Throughout the trial, other members of Wagner's family who pleaded guilty, his brother Jake and mother Angela, have testified against him. However, while on the stand, Wagner claimed his own family lied to him when BCI agents began interrogating his family over the killings. My mom and brother has said that since the beginning. That's why I believe that we were being framed because they said that they were twisting everything that my mom and brother had on their phones and laptops and they were trying to frame us. But during cross-examination, the state pointed out several discrepancies in Wagner's testimony. Prosecutors say in 2017, Wagner told investigators that he'd gone to bed at 12.30 a.m. on the night of the murders after watching a movie with his family. However, in his testimony today, he claimed it was around 10 p.m., which the state says was an entire hour before the killings of the rodents. So how could Jake and your father have been up on the hill killing Chris Sr. and Gary less than an hour after you went into your bedroom? I can't answer that. I don't know. Prosecutors then pressed Wagner on his knowledge after the homicides, questioning him over whether he saw his family the next day. You didn't see him leave? I didn't see my dad leave, no. You didn't see him come back? No. No. Your statement at the border was that you guys all got up and you and Jake left and you got called back and your dad turned on the news. I just remember getting up going tear a building down. I don't remember anything else. Now, Wagner's testimony is complete and the state will be continuing its case with further witnesses. Jennifer.